That is right, very soon you will be able to play solo in this game, but it's not as you would think and there is a huge catch to it. Hello everyone, my name is Mirko and welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another brand new Apex Legends video and in today's video we've got a very interesting topic to be speaking about today because there has been a huge leak suggesting that you will be able to play solo or play in a duo without having them extra teammates, but there's a huge catch to it because this is only a no fill option meaning that if you're going solo then it's going to match you against everyone else that is going solo but there's not going to be a separate solo game mode which is something we all have been wanting ever since the launch of apex legends if you guys don't know what no fill means suggesting it's the same as other games we've seen it basically means that you're going in completely solo and you don't want to have teammates join you now where has this leak come from before we discuss this any further i just want to reassure you guys that this has actually been found in the game files and the person that's dug deep into these files is that one mining guy which if you guys aren't aware what he's done he's basically predicted how season two is all going to plan out and he's also showed things in the past that have all become true and just like the leak we're speaking about today he actually shows us how they are appearing in the game files and this is very clear that it's going to match you up in a solos match if you do a no feel for solos and you're going to get drawn against 60 other solo players but the problem here is if it's struggling to find other solo players players it will put you into a game with other people that are teamed up now that's the big problem for me the fact that if it can't match make it's going to put you into a game with other teams because if you're dropping in solo against teams of three you're already going to have a much harder time when playing this game because you're going to be outnumbered every single time now i honestly think they should have just released a game mode purely for solos which i think is something they're still going to be doing and i still think they're going to be giving us a duos game mode but i think they're doing this for now they're going to test this out see how it goes i think they're mainly going to be doing it to see how many people actually want solos and duos they're probably going to do some statistic tests to see how many people are doing the no fill option but i guess for now that is better than nothing and the fact that we can actually play solo we have that option to play without teammates is something that's been far due and i'm honestly getting so stressed out constantly playing this game having to play with random teammates that sometimes don't even land where i want to land or they just distance themselves completely and the worst thing is when you're playing in a team where two people are communicating with each other in another separate party and you're just left by yourself and you don't know what move they're going to do next the fact that we haven't had the additional solos or duos for all of these months has been a real problem in fact i think it's been the number one problem for this game purely because people are forced to play with teammates every single time and because they don't want to play the team that means they don't work as a team and that just ruins the experience for everyone else so i think it's good that they're given the option for people to play solo that want to play solo and for people to play in a duo that want to play in a duo. Is this game popular enough to consistently get in solo only lobbies where you're always going to be drawn against people playing solo? That's something we're going to have to find out. I'm not sure if this game still maintains that popularity to go into a game all the time and only get drawn against other people that are using the no fill option. That's something we're going to have to find out and the leaked files do suggest that if it's struggling with the matchmaking it will just put you into a standard game with with other people that are drawn up in a team of three so this is something that could be a bit of a problem but depending on how popular the game still is and how the big the player base is we could potentially have no problems with it at all i think crossplay is something that this game needs as well but i guess having this feature is better than nothing if it does plan out to work out really well so anyway guys i'm gonna keep this video short and sweet and i'm gonna wrap this video up here let me know your thoughts down below of this new solo and duo no fill option that is going to be due to launch within the next few weeks in apex legends be sure to let me know your comments down below if you did enjoy this video definitely drop a like down below and if you're new to the channel and you're currently not subscribed be sure you're subscribing as well so you don't miss out on any future apex videos on the channel my name's been Mirko. enjoy the rest of your day and i'll catch all of you guys out in another brand new apex legends video